Hello RVers, this is Greg, and today is Saturday, glorious Saturday, which I've been waiting for all week, because I've been working all week. Unfortunately, weather's crap. And we had plans today to go to the beach and ride our bikes. It's warm enough, but it could rain on us, so I don't know. Uh, we're gonna try it anyway. Say so first things first, I gotta get this off my off my uh, RV and put it on my truck. Or I can put the bike rack in the truck. I have to take off the hitch, which is on the back of my truck, which means one time. Let's go do this. I'd say this way is 50 pounds easy. I'm not sure. Sucker's heavy. Oof. It's not that it's heavy. It's ungainly. It's also heavy. Oh. Come on, oh, okay. Like a glove. If you're wondering why I have this long extension on here, this used to have four on it because I've three bikes. You going for a bike ride? Yes, sir. All right, have fun. I hope so. We'll hope the weather cooperates today. Yeah. All right, let's get the bikes on. And this is why Kim and I like to go to RV parks that are close to Good Bike Pass, so we don't have to do this business, but you take what you got. This is what we got. Crappy day in Texas. Stupid Texas. All right, Kim's on first. Who's on second? Because we weren't putting it on quite right. I gotta blame myself a little bit, but still. So Backwards. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I'm 61 year old grown ass man. That takes a little bit of effort. I like to ride my bicycle. Oh. That's, that's, job done. And they probably won't fall off. I don't know. We normally bring Charlie with us on these sort of adventures, but we're not sure about the weather and we've got friends and so we don't want it to be a big deal and a pain. So you're gonna stay home. Okay, can you watch the trailer? Yeah, okay. I love you too. I love you too so much, I'm gonna miss you. I think the first thing we should do is address the elephant in the truck, which is my gorgeous cute wife with her ponytail. Turn the ponytail, whip it around. That is so cute. Did, did Marie give you that hat? Yes, it's, it's awesome. That's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Oh, thanks, Maria. Uh, so, uh, as I mentioned before, it's kind of crappy weather. We're hoping it, you know, it's warm. It's nice and warm. Albeit a tick humid. Yeah, it is a little Tick humid. Bit. However, uh, we're going to go for it because we've been cooped up in our stupid trailers all week and we can't wait to get out. The weather here has not been great in. Uh, Rockport, Texas. So today the plan is we go to Port Aransas, we get our bikes out. We were gonna bring Charlie, but it, it has a little iffy today. Uh, then we'll ride around the beach, get some lunch, I mean, probably something like that, yeah? Yeah. Actually, we'll probably park in town. Top tip, if you go to Port Aransas, there is a um, little ticket you need to get that costs $5 so you can park on the beach. If you don't get it, you'll have a handy fine of like 500 bucks. So, but it's good do we need that though? Should we park in the city and then ride the bikes to the beach? We'll, we'll see. Rockport is a mecca for RV parks. 
How many RV parks do you think we've seen in Rockport? Fifteen. At least. There Rockport's are so not many. Lockport, Rockport's not a sprawl. It's a fairly small rural area of Texas. And it's on a little peninsula. But I mean, it's okay. It's it's relatively warm for the rest of the country. And I'm sure it has great fishing in that. But yeah. we just don't understand oh look at all those vultures. But we don't understand why so many people are drawn to this area. It must be like the it must be the weather, I guess. But the weather for us so far has been meh. I mean, Make if you're sure gonna you have cash. If you're gonna go to Texas for the weather, go to McAllen. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then you can go down to Mexico and get drugs and tequila. Tequila and drugs. And mix them. <laughs> Just kidding, don't do that. Oh, look at man preaching. I could hear that man through a closed window. He was shouting out. That's a man that loves him some Jesus. There's nothing wrong with that. He doesn't like teeth though. He doesn't have them. Oh, he did? <laughs> I didn't see. Puerto Rancis, five miles. Not much of a wait today. No, there's not. It's always fun to ride a ferry, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Have you ever had a bad experience riding a ferry? <clears throat> Actually, I think I've only had two experiences riding a ferry last week and once in Japan. But this is short. So I'm a total goober. Nope. We stopped here at Finn's. It's highly recommended. I'm using a GoPro with no mic, and there's a music speaker right above me, so I don't know if any of this is going to work. But he ordered what? No, I told him just bring some. Really? Yeah. Oh, surprise. You are you. much braver than me. I got, a, I got no, fish tacos, and she got a burger, Some's and she got a muy caliente Bloody Mary. Don't say that three times. Bloody Mary. Don't say it again. Oh my gosh, that's such a big burger. Uh, I think we should split. Ah. Ooh. 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 Fins. It looks good. Has anybody tasted anything yet? Mmm. Well, I think we all mutually agree that it was a pretty good lunch here at Fins. Uh, not exactly inexpensive. Uh, Kim and I's bill was 70 bucks. We had two margaritas, a burger, and fish tacos. But, you know, it's not terrible, especially since this is sort of a, I guess you'd call this a touristy area. Anyway, now it's back on the bikes and heading to the beach. Are bikes allowed? Oh, can't go. Take my helmet off to do this. That's what I'm willing to do for you. It's a, uh, I mean, it's a pretty, in a way, it's beautiful, but it's a, such a gloomy day. Just like it was last time we were here. Actually, it's not cold, especially. Just gloomy. How you doing? How are you doing? We're just curious. We're we're all full-time RVers. We're staying in uh, Rockport. 
We're curious how this uh, works on the beach business. Uh, you get a, a, a permit and then you can stay on this beach three days every 30? Three days every 10. And you just park wherever you, you can. Yeah. And you can park horizontal or vertical or parallel or well, perpendicular. I, or... I think you're supposed to go perpendicular, but oh. I don't know. I think in the busier season, it's probably a bigger is this deal. Is this the... Is this low season right here? We're not sure. We're not from here. <laughs> so yeah, I'm, I'm assuming this Minnesota, is Minnesota, so I don't yeah. know either. <laughs> okay. I think I think uh, right now temperatures being what they are is just fairly normal. So give it a couple weeks and I think the busy season starts. Hi. You're such a good dog. Oh my gosh, you're a good dog. Hi. Our great day uh, hanging out with the, with the Wigginses. We are going to the boiling pot, which is a local place where they boil seafood and throw it on your table. But that is how it's exactly how it's been described to me. So we'll see. I have to say that was a good day, good friends. That was fantastic, we, that, wasn't it? That day wrapped up really well. Ooh, it was good. So uh, what what is our what is our sign out now? What? Travel what is it what is our sign out? <laughs> what? Our sign out. On. Oh, so okay. they got dogs. Travel on. Oh, wait. Travel on. Boom. <laughs>